Hi guys, Amy Collins here from New Shelves Books. Anna Gray, say hi to everyone. Hi. Anna is one of our marketing folks. She's the one who does the gorgeous images and handles a lot of our social media. And she also is responsible for a lot of the videos that you guys see that our clients are, are using right now to tell everyone what sort of reviews they're getting. And Carrie Barnum, would you say hi to folks? Hello. Carrie is our marketing manager. And truthfully, as someone told me yesterday, she's my boss. Yes, I know I own the company, but Carrie actually does everything. She runs everything. It's scary. Nobody needs me anymore. We are here just for another check-in. We wanted to show you a few more things on Zoom that we thought might be fun. So for those of you who are using Zoom and getting a little more comfortable with it, but you, perhaps you are in a meeting where, where you don't want your full name being used. There may be a number of things that, uh, a number of reasons why you want to change your name. It is super easy to do so. Uh, all you have to do to change your name is you just click on the participants button, go up to me. You can only do this for yourself and hit rename. And so then I want to change my name to Amy queen of all because I have a, you know, uh, complex. There you go. You hit okay. There it is. My name is now Amy queen of all. And when I stop my video, you will see my full name there. Now, let's say that halfway during the meeting, I realize, well, that's silly and embarrassing and I shouldn't do that. You just go back to clicking on the participants button. You hit rename again. You can only rename yourself. So let me go back to Amy Collins. Let me spell my own name right. I hate typing in public. Public typing is awful. Now, if I clicked on host right now, which I'm doing, or on Anna Gray, I'm not allowed to, to change their name. I'm not allowed to do anything. I'm only allowed to change my own. I can mute myself. Hello, 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 hello. And I can unmute myself and I can rename myself, but that's it. So don't worry about someone. Like if I tried to change Anna's name right now to really annoying young person whose hair is way better than mine and I'm jealous, I won't be able to. Yes. All right, another thing that we wanted to show you guys real quick, which is kind of fun, is a virtual background. If you take your mouse and go down to the little arrow, the little clip right here, and choose a virtual background, it's the bottom line, you can actually choose, look at that. Ooh. You're in space. Or you can actually upload a picture. You click this button that says add an image and then choose a picture from your computer. I chose this picture. This is one of my favorites. Make sure the picture you chose you choose is royalty free. Don't, you know, be careful. You don't want to choose a picture that you could actually get in trouble for using. So go to a royalty free site like Pixabay, uh, one of those, um, or make sure it's a photo you took yourself. Uh, so there you go. So I'm going to stop doing this virtual background now because it's well, it's a little silly for business, but um, if, yes? Oh, sorry, I want to jump in and remind you that if you have a lot of windows like I have in the background, it does not work well. Carrie, why so, don't you try one? Let's take a look. Yeah. Okay, so I've got one here. Okay, and can you see how on the right-hand side, right over here, it kind of just looks funny. Yeah. That's because I currently have a different image on. It's an office background, but it's just not working because of all my windows. Yeah. So it's important to remember that you need a solid background for this to work really well. And Anna, you wear glasses. So would you give it a try so people can see what happens if you're wearing glasses? Yeah, you want to be careful with um, the glasses layer because it'll cut half the face. All right. Yeah. So there's a little tidbit about using a virtual background. There's information on how to change your name. We will see you Friday on Free Advice Friday. We look forward to hearing from you at questions at amysadvice.com. Amysadvice.com takes you right to Free Advice Friday. And questions at amysadvice.com will get answered this Friday at 10 a.m. Because every Friday at 10 a.m. Eastern, we are online for one hour answering your questions. Looking forward to seeing you then. Thanks, guys.